Yeah. Welcome yeah. back, everyone, to more of this silly, silly game. Alright, so we just pulled up to this. Let me see, everything's working? Yep, okay. We just pulled up to this boat. And we're going to see if we can find some more of that good old diesel. Sit over here playing around with these stupid boats. Okay. We got it. This boat's full of oil. Here's a diesel. It's not a lot of diesel, but it's some diesel. truck. Okay. Empty. 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 Oil. Keeps almost saving. Alright. Can I turn that autosave off? I mean, that's kind of getting to a point where I'm like, mm, yeah, turn that off. Because that's that's what's causing most of the hitching. I save after every video anyway, so. Now I'm a little more. with how the physics are and everything and if I if I died to something like you know something crap slamming on me then yeah All right, let's go around the outside here and work our way back in seriously only one barrel of diesel out of all of these One whole stinking barrel, and it's only like 20 some liters of fuel. Where did that barrel go? Not, oh, here it is. I was like, hold on. Then. too far off the road. God, hauling a trailer is so jank. But that's the goal, is fill that thing up. I did close that right, yeah. Okay, it's closed up. On the move again. So this is probably our. This is long since come and gone, but I had to get my cars ready for the deep freeze we're getting around here later next week. 
I had to buy some heat to put in gas tanks. I just filled them both up. So like, this is perfect. Got fuel injector uh, stuff with the fuel injector cleaner also made from a car. Just to make sure that it stays up and running great on that. And then stuff without that stuff in it to put in the truck because it has a carburetor. That's just saying, oh, your lights are on. Okay. I'm doing pretty good for going uphill. Maybe a little drink and drink myself. So yeah, and I got my house all set. Because, I mean, it's going to get ludicrously cold. Even for where I live at. speed you'll get up in the window for a bit or so some daylight out. Oh, I didn't think. Okay, so we started what, about 365 or so on this odometer. So we'll get about 415. Try to today. Or an hour's worth of recording, whichever one I feel like doing first. Gosh, I know you guys can hear that. I'm scrambling at the back of the chair. What you doing, Chubbs? Chubby butt. Right. Give me a head butt. That's you, a good boy. Oh, I hate the grasslands. Especially at night, I'm just completely stuck on the road. Come on, bus engine. You know, I'm kind of wondering if there are constellations. It's very doubtful. That was one thing that always impressed me in the original uh, Arma, or Operation Flashpoint, whichever you want to call it. Uh, said the night sky did have constellations and you could use it to navigate, which was just amazing. Because there is a mission where you have to do that. You have to find the North Star and you have to kind of follow it. <laughs> or just do like me and Rambo your way out of there and then jumping out and steal a helicopter and fly out. <laughs> Still, that is a very fun mission. I always like that one. You're the POW. And you're the, well, the helicopter pilot slash fighter pilot that somehow makes sense. And you get uh, captured behind enemy lines because your plane breaks down. That's right, you're flying an A 10 Warthog and then your fuel system goes kaput on you. And you get to ditch behind enemy lines and you get captured, and then you gotta escape to get out. It's so much fun. Because the stealth mechanics in the game are actually really good. God, the AI in the game is way ahead of its time. Alright, who's ready for another horrific crash to come up? Because the trailer ain't liking this. The road's not liking this. The game's not liking this. Oh, man. We're going to keep going for making some good time now. Oh man, the trailer just tried to throw me into that rock.
You know, vehicles built for this kind of speed. Oh, I thought that was a giant rock in the road. Okay. Oh, come on, daytime, please. Come back. You know, as fast as we've been going, we really haven't seen any kind of, like, thing on the side of the road to stop at. Go around it. There we go. I think we really blitzed up that hill. Yeah, this bus engine's a bit of a gas guzzler, but I don't, I, honestly, I don't care. Once we fill up that tanker behind us, the only thing we're going to be stopping for is food and water. I got tons of oil in this thing still. I know some people when I play this game they don't like going in the dark. I just like the, the lighting effects off the street lights, you know, how it kinda of goes through the car like that. It's that's just cool looking to me. I just love that. I used to like driving at night. And then the stupid people got those blue halogen headlights and everyone puts them in every one of their stupid cars because they're stupid. And all I do is blind everybody else. Phil! Phil! So this is where you're hiding? No, where I'm attacking. Run. Everyone has to die. Shotgun. I don't need that. Uh. <laughs> now, what happened to my light that I had sitting on top of the truck? I guess it fell off because I can't attach it anywhere. Oh, I know what I could do. Hold on. And now that's more lights coming off the front. <laughs> hey! I'm brilliant. Ooh, need this. We got us a shiny new mirror, guys. Oops. Door open. Another one. Yes. Oh, what did you do, game? Perfect. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, we're gonna have all the light at night. Wahoo! Super Mario! Okay. Alright, let's see. Somebody sent me a text. Someone was texting me. Okay. Good stuff. Alright, now. All right, we didn't find any fuel, but we have extra lighting. Oh, I really hope that thing didn't get caught up underneath the freaking wheel wells. Look at that shiny mirror now. Giga deep. So now we just got to find a couple of brand new tires for the truck. An AK. Oh, wait a minute. There we go. That's better. There we go. That's point out to front. I'm just going to find an AK and... What else? More fuel. More fuel. And something better tires. Then what we have... Oh! Okay, we're good. No, we're not good. We're not good! Now we're good. Okay, that was that was a little scary, but it's okay. Oh, hold up. Oh, I just got those freaking lights put in there. Okay. It just fell down. We didn't lose it. Okay, it just fell. We're okay. See, I can hear the offset tires squealing. That's what's making that noise. I was making this thing pull to the right a little bit. Still isn't perfect, but it's better than it was. I can still see down the right side now. Okay. Wait a minute now. This is not too far off the road. Fills. More. Nope, we're good. Alright. We don't poop it next to the car. I'm just gonna pick that up at the back of that truck. I'll make a ramp to get it in there. Ooh, what do we have? Some gas. Yeah, we got a lot of bacon. We'll take one of these. Just so that we didn't waste our time coming over here. Definitely up there. Right. We still got both our headlights, right? Yeah, okay. Best time you tap bacon is when you're out of water. <laughs> Nothing as far as the eye can see. Speed yet? Let's just see. This is just a freaking outhouse out here in the middle of nowhere, right?
Yep. Well, let's just stay on top of the hill here for a second. Okay, and we are out of food. Now I should say we're hungry. I'm not going to make it too much of a habit getting off the road like this. Yeah, I'm not stopping at those watchtowers anymore. It's just not worth it. I mean, early game, you kind of want to stop to see if you can use like, an early revolver, shotgun, just something, but right now, it just ain't worth stopping. I need to reload my shotguns. I need to you know, ammo together, consolidate, I'm just going to box out. Next time we stop, we'll do that. This is kind of nice. The trailer's just kind of driving my truck around. Oh, we got another ship. Heck yeah, let's get some more diesel thrown in the back of this thing. It's not too far off the beaten path, so let's just jump on it. Mock speed! We are currently breaking the sound barrier. In a Bedford lorry. things first, we gotta consolidate some ammo. Um, wait a minute. Get that up. Come on. Get out of there. Come on. You can do it. I believe. Come on. Okay, hold on. Okay. You could go away. There, I'm gonna full set of ammo. Alright, we'll start at this end. Of course, way out here by itself. Of course, the top of the hall. And work our way to the other side of the ship. Okay. And it starts getting too dark. this one to fill up our oil tank. Sit right there. Bunch of diesel. That's a good find right there. We'll sit you out here too. Oh, more diesel. Sweet. 
So far, this is a good stop. Ooh, we hit the jackpot. I've noticed any time I've ever been in these ships, I don't find like a barrel of water. It's a, it's a liquid. You'd think that you know they would potentially have that capability. There's some good two-stroke. Ooh, we. done before dark. And one last barrel of diesel. It ain't much in it, but it's a thing. Let's go. We're done here. A little bit of everything, but there was a lot of diesel here. That is good. Alright, we're going to fill up our tank with this one. Or, well, try to fill it up with this one. I don't think it will. It might. It gets very, very close. One liter away. Top that off. What are you? Okay. Oh, come here. All right. Climb up here. There we go. Open. Pour. Throw. All right. These are all. Oh wait, no. These are not all diesel. Also, diesel is the fatty. Ooh, 822 liters, baby. All right, let's open up. those work at first. See what they do. I know they have the longest range, but, you know. I mean, it would work in a pinch if you lose your, you know, your main headlights. Okay. 
Uh, we're back on the road. We'll creep up this hill. One thing we need to find now is start collecting water, I think. Well, I don't know if I need to collect 40 liters of water in the back. I don't need a lot of it. Usually I find some. We'll stop up here. See what's as good as we can find. We still gotta find tires, and we still gotta find. Uh... We're always in need of ammo. I got tons of revolver ammo, thankfully. If I need to fall back on that, but I got a lot of assault rifle ammo actually. I just need to find an assault rifle. Ooh, another tanker. Good tire. Oh, come on! Mmm, it's not perfect. Alright, what's in here? <gasps> Look at the jackpot, boys. Alright, um, let's pull that truck up. Perfect. Crank it up. That's as fast as it'll go. Alright. I mean, I guess we can do this like 40 liters at a time. I would hook this thing up, get us a big old, you know, convoy tray, but that's just too much. <laughs> I could just do this. enough for what I want to do. Alright, now. Pull it up. Right there. it up. And this is how we're going to fill our truck up too when we start dipping into that. Yeah, and this way we can still move while we're carrying this thing. Oh, shoot. Come here. left in this. Yeah, I was going to do two more.
I empty it out. Now, if we find another one of these and I fill that one up that we're carrying, then yes, I will hook it up and we'll have a a very long convoy going of trailers of fuel. <laughs> so yeah, that's that, that could be like an additional objective. Whoa. This is just the hardest part is climbing up the darn back of this thing. Okay. Alright, put you back in there. Whoa! Put that in there. Pick you up. Put you in there. Hop in. Oop. And away we go! Okay, it's close. Yeah, we just filled up that tank. I mean, I'm not worried about topping it off every time we stop, so. Where are we at? About 30 more to go, right? We have found a lot in a short amount of time. Here we go, now we're cooking with gas. Let's get going here. It'll fuck around here and stop. But the last two stops have been very profitable. And we've cleaned up our mirror today. And we're slowly collecting a line of lights to build the dashboard to make the truck just have all the lighting ever. Actually, if I get another one, I'll, I'll stop at three. Because I'll get annoying going click, 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 click. <laughs> then I get annoying clicking all over the dashboard trying to get stuff going. We made it through another night. No real major problems. We had one minor accident that basically had a light fall on the floorboard. That was it. Thankfully, that was all that happened. Oh dear. I didn't realize just how steep this hill was. Oof. We're, we're losing speed. Oh, we're down to about 27 kilometers per hour. That's up 30. We hit 30. You know what I might do? Just take two of the really perfect tires off the back of that trailer and the next stop and put it on the truck. That way I make sure that what the truck has is perfect. Because that's where all of our propulsion and steering are and then just whatever on the back of that thing. Oh man, we're down to 20. What's going on here? Okay, we don't have like a so I'm stuck on this thing, do we? 
That is cool, you can actually see the drive shaft whirlwinds. There's a transfer case. Cool. I'm not sure why there's a differential on the front axle. Oh, it's got. St okay, this thing has leaf spring suspension. That's why it's wa wallowing all over the place. But you can actually see it working. Okay, I'm even more impressed by this game's physics. I mean, this is great. But that's why this thing's so freaking leany everywhere. <laughs> it's got leaf spring suspension on the front and the back. Who designed this crap? This is a guy named Stagecoach. Now, I can see it on the trailer. I can see it on the rear to an extent. Because leaf springs are actually pretty, you know, solid for hauling things. And you put a little weight on them and they actually, like, you know, when they settle in, they, they get real stiff. And then it, it smooths your ride out. I found out in the truck the other day when I hauled that dresser home. There's a little cabinet. It's a little drawer cabinet thing. And, uh, that thing had to weigh at least 100 pounds. I mean, that thing is god dang heavy for just how small it is. But, uh, I slapped that in the back of that truck. I mean, it smoothed that ride out good. Like, that truck was riding great. Or better than my car, actually. Or about the same as my car. Oh, we're in a, is this a snow biome? I think we made it in the snow. I think it's the second time we've been here. Oh, and uh, Mr. Truck is not going out into the snow and ice that's supposed to be coming up here. That is one thing the truck does not do because it is not going in salt. Ever. I don't care. I don't care what's going on. I ain't putting that truck in salt. My car has been installed. It, it it came from Pennsylvania, so it came right out of the rust belt. It had a little bit of rust on it, like like surface rust is what it had. And because I was even thinking, oh my god, it's kind of like five years old. Is that much rust around everything? But I started thinking, like, oh, then I found out where it had been from the previous GPS uh, navigation things. I was like, oh, this thing was in Pennsylvania. Well, that makes sense. It's only been up there a couple of years. Like I drove for a couple of years. I think maybe two years of its life was actually driven, and then it just sat around because it was a previous lease vehicle. I don't know what happened to it after that. It just sat on a car lot, and then CarMax bought it at an auction or something. And yeah, it's been good to me. Like I got to put a drive belt in it. Uh, I've got I've got the belt. I just gotta pick a day to do it. I'm not doing it this weekend. But the belt's not bad. It just squeaks. It's got belt noise. It's just and it's a little bit over past due for it to be changed, but it's fine. I just got to get it changed when I'm ready to. Um, I don't know if I want to stop here. I mean, I'm going slow enough. We can stop. Oh, there's another tanker. We got to stop the hill. What do we got? Oh my gosh, we had to We are getting all the diesel guys. Alright, let's check this place out, make sure there's no fills around. Get some water, which I will happily partake in. There we go. That we got a Jeffrey. What the heck was that? Oh, a freaking hatch for one of those cargo trailers. Well, 
cookie. Oh, there is. There's a cookie. Oh, another cookie. Ooh, piece of cane. There. My health will go back up a little bit. Alright. Let's get to get known. Alright, 40 at a time makes four trips. Uh oh, spilled a little bit. That's alright, that's alright. I couldn't see. I was like, I need to know how many I'm doing here. No! What? Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. <laughs> hey! We are over a third of the way to our goal of filling up this trailer, and we've got a lot done today. Slap bang on! It's the last load we gotta do, so. Okay, rabbit went over there. Didn't fill up the tank again, but yeah, like I said, whatever. Just, main thing is to fill up the main our trailer tank there. Oh wait, that's one thing I was gonna do. Hold on. Okay, that's a perfect tire. Thank you. 
that was not. Maybe I've already done it. It hasn't really been pulling anywhere, so we'll keep looking. I know I got a bad one on the back there, so. Alright, we're good. Let's get moving. 20 kilometers to go? Yeah. We're getting close to that hour mark. We might just go and bang that out. Knock it out! Be done with it. What time is it? Jeez. It's only four in the afternoon. We spent much oh my gosh. Um guys, are you ready to go fast? And we're flipping. Come on. Just back over. Get back over. Come on. Oh, this is not good. Alright, so here's what we gotta do. Stuff's dumping out. No, 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 no. Okay, detach that. That'll put the self back over. No, I should have put the brake on. We'll go find it. Push you back over. Okay, quickly, quickly, quickly. We gotta go. We gotta go get the trailer. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, we'll get, get the stuff back in the freaking truck. Is that everything? That's everything. There it is. Okay, I didn't go too far. Hey, right now we just gotta follow it. Oh man, we are going so far. Oh, gonna hit that tree. All right, sweet. Thank you, tree. Okay, mental note, engage the freaking parking brake before you <laughs> detach this thing. Oh. oh that, hook it, that hooked it up. Alright, well we're going. <laughs> Slant, oh no, it did not hook it up. I'll go back into the tree and thank, thank for me. Okay. Okay. Oh, you annoying turn. All right. Okay. Everything's back in the truck, except our one empty drum, at whatever. Uh, we'll find something. I got an empty uh, cherry cane back there anyways, and shit anyways. Next stop, we'll reconnoiter our losses. Do need at least an empty jerry can to fill this thing with. Oh, that trailer is being a nightmare back there. I can feel it. Oh no! Oh, yeah! What is happening? Okay. It's still back there. What's going on here? Why, why wouldn't it move? It? Okay. We're good. Yeah, we still got our wheels. Everything's still good.
Something's not right. Oh gosh. Okay. Ow. You get back on there. Okay. Um, I just need some spray for the dash. I busted my nose in the dash, but we're okay. Yeah, kind of busted my nose a little bit, but we're okay. We're fine. Mmm, that hurt. We see our wheels. Trailer's still back there. We're good. We're fine. This is fine. See my head and dash a little bit. That's all. So I got a radio. The center console came up a little bit, but I put it back in. <laughs> Just snapped it back in, and, you know. flipping over here. Game's hitching. Okay, we're just gonna kinda go straight here. Oh, I'm flipping. Oh, I did that one. I did that one. Oh, I saw a trick. Wheel come off. Oh, there goes things. Things are falling off. I saw that wheel come off. God dang it. I knew it. Oh, I lost the freaking grill. Okay, we still got all our stuff back here, thankfully. But yeah, I saw that wheel come off. It's back up the road here a little bit. Yep, here it is. You thought you could fool me, game? Think again. Yeah, we're gonna start slowing down. I think that's because of the weight of the trailer, it's really making this thing just buck all over the place. Tumbleweed. That's a rabbit. Anybody see the rear view mirror? Oh, there it is. No! Okay, we're back underway. Turn that off. Turn that off! Oh no! Okay, why did you fall over? Oh, son of a base kid, man. Okay, don't crush my truck. Ooh. Shut the door. 
Oh no. Got to take rabbits up underneath the truck. Get out of here! I mean, just everything's going wrong right now. Everything's going wrong. Oh my gosh, where is my, sp my speedometer? My speedometer and my fuel gauge are missing. Okay, will you please stop hitching for like just two goddamn seconds? They could be in the cab of the truck. I don't know, but I'm still gonna go backtrack a little bit. Oh, yeah, something is. Yeah, something's bad off. Something's hanging around in the floor somewhere. Alright. Well, we've got daylight coming up. Oh, there's one. Okay, we got that. There. Okay, good. We've got that back in. Now, I would kindly like to have a temperature gauge. You! You fucking reason! Well, we need to be on the lookout for another truck so we can find. Oh, and we're missing a headlight. So we need to find a headlight. Hence why I have these spares. Um, and a temperature gauge. Stupid game, stupid. All right, all right. We're gonna go until we find another resting point. Oh, wait, I know what I can do. One thing I can. Actually, wait a minute. Not this. This. At least got to pull off the dash. <laughs> I need a temp gauge. I've got a fuel gauge, that's good. We've got our, our speedometer and odometer back. The odometer is what about the most important thing I wanted. Alright, we're missing a temperature gauge. Not the worst thing in the world to be missing, but I like to have all the gauges. I don't know how that popped out, but it did. Yeah, we're gonna start riding the brake going downhill. Cannot have that going on anymore.
mercy. Might be again a couple minutes before we find a place to stop, because uh, this has been, I mean, this has been a very productive video. We've gotten a crap ton of fuel, but we have had two horrific accidents. Busted my head on the, on the dashboard. Lost my temperature gauge now. Had wheels fly off. Lost my, my spare drum that I used to fill this thing with. Oh, okay, here's our next stop. Yeah, let's make a place to stop. I'm gonna be a fill here, I can take my range out on. Fail! Sawed-off shotgun. Huh. Put that down there. Okay. Is there anything in here worth a day? No, there isn't. All right, well, this is going to be all for today then, guys. So tune in next time. We try to get somewhere without crashing. Later. <laughs>